So in this video, I'm going to show you the easiest and fastest way to mobile optimize your show it website. So how I always build is I do the entire desktop version like this. And then when you go to mobile, it looks like a jumbled hot mess. So there are a few easy, quick tips on how to make this more efficient. And that's exactly what I'm going to show you. So the first thing I'm going to do is, and I do this every time. So you'll see these three dots on whatever canvas you are currently in. And I normally go through and I title all of them. So I kind of know what I'm working in, but you can click layout mobile here. And when you do that, I would always click scaled. You'll see automatically it just copied over the fonts, the colors, the image, everything like that. So if I click OK and go to mobile, you'll see it looks pretty similar. Not quite there, but that's OK. So I'm going to drag it down and then I'm just going to play around with all of my elements. And then obviously, do 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 make all of my text sizes way, way smaller. So that was super easy. It took me barely any time at all. And definitely some sections are a lot easier. Like I'll come down here and show you how quick this takes. go. That is the fastest way. And I would just go through like that. So you see that, you know, both of those sections took me maybe like a minute and a half. So if I have five more, then it would take me like less than 10 minutes to do this whole page. One quick tip that I would recommend is making sure that your font sizes are all consistent throughout your page. And an easy way to do that is by clicking, let's say I like this size for my main paragraph. I can click Command C and then come down here and I can click Shift Command V and you'll see that it just changed it black because it's black up here and what that's doing is changing it so that it has the exact same settings which is so helpful once you have all of your text sizes throughout here just so that it's really really consistent. You can also do buttons like this. So let's say this button is gray. Okay. But I want it to be red. So what I'd do is come over here, take this box and click command C. What I would do over here is click shift command V and it copied that red over. And this all saves a ton of time as well. If you're trying to go from desktop to mobile. So that is my biggest advice when you're mobile optimizing your mobile version on show it. If you've enjoyed this video or learned anything, make sure to subscribe and like and comment anything else that you want to learn from me about show it or web design or anything branding. Cause that's my shit. Okay. Much love you guys. Mwah.